Hello everybody. Um, I decided to make a video today on a bug I found in the game. So let's start off with, it's about grenade trajectory and their physics. So let's start off with throwing com and comparing a left click grenade and a double click grenade, which is mouse one and two. So here's your left throwing click grenade. Flashback. And then here's your double click grenade. I'm throwing a flashback. So left click clearly goes further than your double click. That's how it's supposed to be. Left click's most powerful, double click's second most powerful. That happens all the time except for one thing. So, let's line up uh, with like this square. It's fine. And let's aim past a 45 degree angle. I'll show you what angle I'm talking about right now, actually. So I throw the angle I'm talking about is with the ground and the trajectory at which you throw it. So this is the angle right here. So this is um, this is like 20 degrees. So it's before 45. We can also so let's compare the left click and the right click now. So let's aim at this black dot, I guess. We're gonna compare left click and double click. And then so here's left click. Throwing a flashback. And here's double click. Throwing a flashback. So it's clear, even though right or left click has a bit more power in the throw, it'll go a bit further. It's clear that left click goes further than double click, which is how it's supposed to be. This happens. Uh, the only time that it doesn't happen is so. Let's line up here and throw past 45 degrees. So this is your left click, flashback, and this is your double click. I'm throwing a flashback. So, wait for it to fade. This was the double click, this is the left click. What does this mean? This means that even though double clicks are less powerful, they have more downward velocity. And what does that mean for uh, the game? So, basically, that means if you're planning to pop flash off the ground, it is more efficient and better to use a double click for a higher pop. Like, a, er, a higher, more powerful nade, even though left click is more powerful. So I'll show you, um, so if we're looking straight down and throw as we run, it works with any any type. So, and then we look straight down and throw again. This shows that the double click goes further than the left click. Uh, it also works with jumping, so if we stand still and flashback. there's a right, there's a left click throw, and then we stand still a That's bad one. Hold on. Uh, left uh, double click is hard to throw. I'm throwing a flashback. Right, let me get. Hold on. Flashback. There we go. So these go further than right click. The other thing I found interesting is that these will pop in midair. Why is that useful? Well, if we come over here into Mirage, let's say we're taking a site. We decide to flash out. We get really close up here so nobody can see. And we left click throw. Throwing a flashback. This will hit the ground 100% of the time. It gives the CTs more time to react. However, if we do our double click, I'm throwing a flashback. it will never make a sound except for the one you throw. It will always pop in mid -air. You will always have basically a silent approach rather than the clunkety clunk of the decoy. I hope it's useful somewhat. I don't know. Thanks for watching.